Do you enjoy thrift shopping among huge crowds in the alleys of your city's bazaars? Do you wish to continue to do so from the comfort of your couch? Now, post-COVID, a lot of people have become hesitant to step out in the hustle and bustle of a busy market, but their love for thrifting remains intact. The answer to this is online flea market. Online flea market culture is not new to India. In 2016, Yapli, a social networking platform, onboarded over 1,200 sellers and buyers to sell their products online. Flea markets go online. Now, what is an online flea market? Whether you're looking to purchase a vintage handbag, sell an antique tea set, or buy some designer vintage clothes for half the retail price, online flea markets allow you to do so. Just like actual flea markets, online marketplaces allows vendors to connect with buyers and sell previously owned merchandise for a fraction of the original price. They also promote sustainable consumption and help collectors and vintage lovers find and purchase rare items. How is it becoming a trend? Before Covid struck, city folks escaped to flea markets over the weekends. The bustling markets haggling on prizes or gorging on food from carts, citizens miss the vibrant flea markets that once made them look forward to weekends. All of that is now shifting online due to the pandemic. Since the nationwide lockdown reduced outdoor activity, over 45% of small businesses have had to rethink their way of conducting business. They were able to set up shops online and promote them on social media using Instagram, Facebook and Twitter to draw customers. Since 2020, e-commerce has played a major role in small businesses, continuing to find customers online. Small businesses have had to pull down the shutters on their offline stores and switch to social media, websites and e-commerce store platforms. There has also been increased support from loyal customers, fans and followers of flea markets. With Instagram and Facebook, companies promoting flea markets are seeing constant buzz around the different sellers and brands featured. Personally curated or anything new, customers are always open to experimenting with creative ideas. And that is what flea markets are all about. Social media community has seen several homegrown businesses emerge, especially during the lockdown. From gourmet foods, art and craft products, clothing, decorations and whatnot. The future. Whether it is the Prime Minister's hashtag vocal for local movement or the government's hashtag Atmanirbhar scheme to boost small businesses, online flea markets have identified the ideal way to stay relevant. Platform for Artists is a community building platform that brings together creative individuals under one roof. They started hosting their event online called Unseen that has already had its four editions. They set up forms, screen hundreds of artists, collaborate with platforms like Instamojo to set up online stores and feature them on our website for customers to browse and shop. Going forward, these small businesses and artists have to be tech savvy and use social media to spread the word about their businesses. Networking via webinars and WhatsApp is another way to consistently share updates about the products they offer, their pricing and their authenticity. By increasing their brand awareness online, figuring out the logistics of delivery, upskilling and pivoting the business model to suit the new normal, the online flea market has a bright future. Would you shop at an online flea market or do you still prefer wandering among small stores on the streets? Share your thoughts and opinions with us and keep watching.